everyone so today we will learn about viewport units and majorly viewport width and viewport height so before that i want you to understand what is a viewport so in simple terms the visible portion of the screen is called as viewport for example here you can see that there is a browser and you can see this window with a white background this is my viewport at any point of time if i decrease the screen size for example okay this is my viewport okay this small rectangle is my viewport so i hope viewport is very clear and from the left point till the right point what we call as width in general is viewport width and top to bottom or bottom to top is called as viewport height so if i decrease now this will be the viewport width and this will be the viewport height that is it so let me just start off with h1 and i'm going to tell this is let us learn vw and vh vw means viewport width and vh means viewport height okay and then in style.css i have reset everything i haven't used um, box sizing uh, because i think here we are not going to use margin and padding much so it's not needed so h1 you know that it's a block level element so what i'll do is i'll add a border i'll say 3px solid um red right and i'll refresh this so you can see um that since this screen is converted to 50 50 that is half and half so my viewport width is from left side to right side okay as of now we will speak about it in detail now what i would like to do is i would like to say that my width is um, 50 vw okay now what does this mean okay i'll write a comment so that it will be very clear uh, 50 percent of what is visible on the screen okay 50 percent of what is visible on the screen what is visible on the screen as i said is viewport right whatever is visible at that point in time is viewport now 50 percent of what is visible on the screen so you can see that 100 percent is visible if we consider this as 100 and then 50% of whatever is visible. So this will be my 50 V W. I'll increase the screen size. And now you can see that it has increased, right? So this is the 100% of my viewport. And this is the 50%. So this is the 50, this mark. Correct. And now I can have 10 also. Okay, it looked dirty. But you can see that this is the 10%. So I think viewport width is um, actually easy to understand. So to summarize whatever is visible on the screen is my viewport and i can utilize how much ever i want now this is 10 percent of the total portion that is visible on the screen and if i make this 100 you can see that it's spanning across the screen okay uh, now one more question most of the people have does viewport change yes here i have ipad air i have just toggled the device and you can see that um, this is the 100 percent of what it is and i'll inspect this um, if i can select and inspect and here you can I'll, I'll reduce this okay and you can see that for that particular screen it's 49 viewport width 50 for example 50 percent of the viewport width. so i hope i hope viewport is very clear the viewport width now let us learn about viewport height again i'll split the screen now viewport height is also simple for that what i will do is i'll comment this part I'll tell you a real use case when do we use it so to give a better design what we usually do is um, you can use section but i'll use div and i'll have class as one and i'll write this is first part and then i'll copy this i'll write two over here t w o and i'm going to write this is the second part okay as of now you cannot see anything but we'll use the styling so i'm going to target the class name respective one and i'm going to give a background color of wheat you can give any background color you want so you can see that the first part is wheat and the second one two i'll give a background color of uh, i don't know blue it looks dirty but that is fine as of now for the demonstration part and let me also give color so that you can see the um, font right color is white but here i want to put up a very interesting point that 
let us say 100 vh is equal to 100 percent of what is visible on the screen right so i'm going to say height is 100 vh so you can see that this will increase massively and at this point of time 100 vh is uh, uh, from the top to bottom this is 100 vh okay 100 percent of what is visible on the screen and the same thing i'm going to add right so you can see two scrolls and this is a wonderful design whenever we are designing any kind of thing right uh, so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to decrease the size correct i'm going to decrease the size and you can see that still if even though the size is decreased you can still see that the viewport height adjusts to whatever our visual portion is okay that is very important to know right viewport as i said is the part of the screen that is visible so whenever the screen resizes it automatically adjusts okay so you can see percentage is not like this percentage depends on the parent this doesn't depend on the parent this depends on the size of the screen at that point in time whatever it is so if you ask me if i uh, switch on the device toggle and let me just choose iphone 12 pro you can see that 100 percent of what is visible the width and the height it gets automatically adjusted right so simple viewport is whatever is visible on the screen at that point in time and viewport width is again the width that is visible and the height is also that is visible at any screen size so i hope you liked that video thank you so much for watching and stay tuned subscribe to our channel